Shakespeare Festival St. Louis begins the 15th year of its education tour this spring. And here with all the details is director of the education tour, Joanna Battles. Thank you for being here. Thank you for having me. So you're kind of gearing up right now to bring Shakespeare to schools across the state, really. Tell me about the education tour. Yeah, so the education tour deals with two different shows, actually. We have a um, company of professional actors who are doing Midsummer Night's Dream, which complements actually our uh, professional show in the summer in Shakespeare Glen that's running through June, um, and also Hamlet. So the it's a 50-minute version of both of the shows, okay. so it's an abridged version, um, specifically geared towards kids. The Midsummer show is geared towards the younger kids, the elementary school and middle school, mm -hmm. um, and Hamlet is geared more towards middle school and, and high school students. Um, our professional company also is, uh, they're teaching artists, mm -hmm. and so they also present some workshops, educational workshops, as a complement to the shows. Okay, so they basically schools can contact you and say, I want you to come here, and it's going to be a 50-minute abridged version of one of the two plays, uh, at least for this season, um, and then followed by the workshops. And what type of workshops? What, what do you do? Is it just like a Q&A, or is there more to it? Well, definitely we have a Q&A to begin with because the kids are really excited. Mm -hmm. um, often they'll ask, you know, how did you learn all those lines, <laughs> et cetera, um, which our actors are more than happy to mm -hmm. connect with the kids. Um, but then after that, they have a choice. The schools have a choice of three different workshops. One of them is about creating work, so it's actually a playwriting workshop. It's called See It, Read It, Write It. Um, another workshop is called To Thine Own Self Be True, and that is about character development. And so our teaching artists help the students um, through a series of explorations just about inner um, character uh, awareness, mm -hmm. etc. And then the last workshop is um, called Speak the Speech, and that is uh, primarily about breaking down the language of Shakespeare, mm -hmm. understanding the meter and the rhythm and the melody of the poetry. So you've been doing this now, this is the 15th year, so mm -hmm. what do you see as some of, the, some of the benefits of this program? Yeah, well, you know, a lot of the students that we're performing for, this is the first uh, experience that they've ever had with live theater or with Shakespeare. And so as a result, it's really important for us that they're, uh, they're not intimidated by the language and that they find it really easily accessible. Mm -hmm. um, they're excited. A lot of our shows are really action-packed um, and really fun. And mm -hmm. so as a result, they say, wow, um, you know, theater can be really fun. And mm -hmm. we hope that then they'll go home to their parents and say, let's go see a show. Mm -hmm. I mean, Shakespeare is not necessarily easy to tackle, I feel, unless you have an introduction from it from an early age in education. You know, if you exactly. start reading something in middle school because it's assigned in your English class, it kind of makes the next step, um, you know, a little bit easier. I mean, what do you think are some of, amongst the students, like the sort of miss perceptions or misconception of Shakespeare. I mean, yeah. that it is intimating, that it is too highbrow. Is that kind of what you hear from students? Definitely. And also that it's it's not, it's unrelatable, right? Mm. That it's some old guy, you know, dead guy that wrote this 400 years ago. <laughs> right. And, and it has nothing to do with them. But actually the themes that, that come up, um, bullying, jealousy, mm. first love, um, you know, deciding who you are and what you stand for are just completely relatable, especially for kids, you know, who are really trying to discover who they are in their place in this world. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. And so schools right now can contact you, right? We yes, okay. yes. We have openings available. We start the, um, the tour starts February 8th. It runs through mid-April, April 17th. Um, and we are traveling throughout the St. Louis area, but also Missouri um, in general, so yeah. rural, county, et cetera. All right, well, we've got that information there for you on the screen at Shakespeare Festival St. Louis. It's the education tour, um, as Joanna said, all around not just St. Louis City and the county, but all around Missouri. And so right now they have schools that they've already scheduled, but they're open to accommodating more. So please reach out to them if you're interested. The phone number on the screen is 314-531-9800 or visit FS. SF, Shakespeare, <laughs> SFSTL.com. But we're going to have more with Joanna. We're going to talk more about Shakespeare, Shakespeare Festival St. Louis's education tour right after this. So please stay with us.